in 24 hours. Mr. Prigozhin has reminded me of two particular Roman events, which is extraordinary. Uh, the first, of course, is uh, the idea in January 49 BC, when Julius Caesar crossed the Rubicon, rather a, rather a small river, in fact. Um, he wasn't the first Roman general to do that. I think Sulla was the first, and uh, Caesar brought his army into the uh, territory of Rome itself and broke the law in doing so, putting, um, putting the fear of God, of course, into the Roman uh, senators who were, who, who were um, thwarting his plans. Um, the other, the other um, thing that uh, Prigozhin has done today, I mean, by literally by, 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 by moving from Ukraine into Russia proper and taking um, Rostov, uh, Prigozhin crossed the Rubicon. And then suddenly when Moscow is in his sights, when really the defences of Moscow are down, why did he, why did he um, turn back? And this is right, rather like being in sort of 2012 BC or whatever it is after um, the, the great battles uh, of Hannibal coming down with his elephants uh, from the Alps. Uh, why did Hannibal turn back from Rome? Why did he not attack Rome? Uh, there, there are many reasons, of course, uh, that are advanced, but we don't know. Was it that his army was too small, that he didn't have supply lines, um, that Rome was better defended than he thought, um, that it was just logistically impossible, that he um, uh, couldn't realistically defeat Rome when her allies in Latium were uh, still strong. Um, it, it, it simply impossible to to know why he didn't do it was he afraid of a siege well certainly not and um and uh, was he afraid of 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 torching the area well he'd been doing that for quite a while so why did he suddenly change his mind i remember there was an old hollywood musical which um suggested there was a reason um but i think um that was as improbable as the idea um, today that the dictator of Belarus had a hand in um, in, in negotiating some sort of um, alternative scenario. Yes, today, within 24 hours, Prigozhin crossed the Rubicon and turned back from Rome. Extraordinary. <laughs>